It's been a tough journey. In April of 2007, I had a That's major awesome. stroke. Mm -hmm. I remember it was really tough on us. Yeah, we just got married and we had a whole future ahead of us. Never saw it coming. I never saw it coming. You had slurred speech. You couldn't use your right hand. It was very devastating. I said, uh, I love to play the organ, love to play the piano. I wondered if I'd still be able to do that. But I just kept cheering you on. Yes, you, mm -hmm. you were a great wife. You Thank are you a so great beautiful. wife. <laughs> Thank you. And, uh, you know, gradually, gradually with a lot of prayer from the family, mm -hmm. uh, gradually got to improve, improve, improve. Mm -hmm. Six months later, a beautiful daughter was born, Leah. Mm -hmm. She's a blessing. I'm so glad I was able to see our beautiful daughter born. I can just imagine mm -hmm. if I wasn't there, I would, uh, I would have missed out on so much. You sure would. Missed out on her taking her first step. Missed out on her saying, Ma, Mama, Dada. She's one of the reasons uh, that give you that sense of purpose for living, that sense of purpose for going on everything. You know, when she was about three years of age, right. I introduced her to the piano. After she did piano for a couple of years, I remember you came to me and said, Paul, I think I'm one lady to do the violin. She really took on to the violin. She's a gifted child, and I thank God for her every day. My family is why I want to get up every morning. Mm -hmm. My wife, my daughter, I look forward to spending my time with my daughter, uh, nurturing her, instructing her, guiding her. Yeah, we really her. have to be here. We yeah. have full potential. Mm -hmm. I just got to continue to live, mm. continue to live, continue to live. I see. Live for her. My daughter, Leah, is why. <laughs>